with you to say that this particular student, probably of all the students that I've ever had tried this stand-up comedy thing, is probably my favorite student. <laughs> I think you're going to agree with me if you'll put your hands together, please, and welcome to the stage, Mr. Mike Gorgoni. Mike! Come tell us what's funny. Thanks, Chris. Hi, my name is Mike Gorgoni, and I feel like my job is slowly driving me crazy. Um, I've been working the graveyard shift at a 7-Eleven for the last three years now, and yeah. <laughs> it's the little things that are starting to get in me. Stuff that, when I started working there, maybe were only slightly irritating, but now that I've been three years into it and experienced these things thousands upon thousands of times, they're just fraying at the last strands of my sanity. It's things like people taking more than one penny from the penny jar. <laughs> it's take a penny, leave a penny, not take 37 pennies because you can't afford a pack of Marlboro Lights. <laughs> or, or the little girls who come in and start giggling their little heads off and they spill half a gallon of Slurpee all over the floor because it's so funny that they've made me an extra half hour's worth of work. <laughs> I don't find it nearly so amusing. <laughs> Or the guys who come in and assume that we're still working under the barter system. If the sign on the rack says $5.99 plus bottle deposit, you can't walk up to the counter, hand me $3 and say, that's all I got, bro. Because <laughs> unless you got five radishes and a goat tucked away back behind that faux hawk of yours, I'm not accepting that deal. <laughs> but the worst, easily the worst, has got to be the doorbell. Ding dong. Every time someone comes to the door, it's ding dong. Or any time they stand near the door, ding dong. And then they just keep standing there, ding dong. Because that wouldn't get irritating, ding dong. It's not slowly driving a certain clerk into an ever widening spiral of madness, ding dong. It's not going to one day result in me tearing it off the wall and clubbing them over the head with it. Because that would be crazy. My name's been Mike Rigoni, and that's been my time.